If you're into that 80s vibe, you can check out the Club Vector clothing range. Link for that is down below, as is the link for U7 Buy. Cut out the nonsense of FIFA points and the random gamble, and just go straight to the source. Use the code TVM at checkout. What is going on guys, TVM here. Welcome back to yet another 6 o'clock content video. I have absolutely no idea whether EA are going to do anything today, but with the Player of the Month Messi dropping tomorrow, I would not be surprised to see another tempting SBC to get cards off the market. Now, we do have rewards tomorrow, uh, but a brand new Team of the Week has just dropped, and I don't think that's going to be enough. I don't think EA are going to look at that and go, that's enough to get people spending money. That's enough to get people using their cards and, and, and getting things off the market. So... They're going to drop something today. I can feel it in my bones. Now, we already have Team of the Tournament Tagliafico. That's got two days left. Morelos dropped a few days ago. Again, that's got two days left. Uh, they both expire on Friday. So we should get something Footmas related then, I would have thought. Uh, the group stage for the UCL objective is there for another 24 hours if you're interested. Um... And that's pretty much about it. You know, as you know, I don't really do anything on this account. They've dropped no new milestones from what I can see. So no new objectives. Um, let's jump into the SBC and see what they've given us. So here we go. We've got Hakimi. I knew they would. I knew they'd do it. They could not resist. It's another one. It's a rear Electrum uh, inside the box. It gives you a rear Electrum. That wasn't there yesterday. I know... UEFA Marky Moments was there yesterday because everyone was laughing about it. Inside the box is there today, and they've also dropped a Hakimi, and that's it. So this, again, like I said, it's another one of those tempting SBCs. He's only 82 rated, only requires one team. Um, he's, I mean, it's, it's dreadful already, I can see, because he's a right mid. If it was a defensive style player, then I wouldn't be against this at all. Like, if he was a left back, which I think is what he is... For Dortmund, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, I wouldn't be against it so much. Although low defensive work rate, maybe. So high low, two star weak foot, three star skills. It's just not a great card for, for any position, really. Even if it was a defensive, even if he was like a left back or a right back, it's just not. It's just not great. Um, he's got. He hasn't got one stat above 80 for defensive uh, capability. His stamina is good. But apart from that, his short passing is okay, but his vision is terrible. His shot power is okay, but his finishing and his long shots are terrible. Um, his composure is not the best. His reactions are okay. Dribbling's decent, I suppose. Um, in fact, his dribbling is very good, but he doesn't have much in the way of agility. It's just not a good card. No matter which way you... Not even I can put a positive spin on this. You know, last couple of days, Munier I thought was decent. Um, even Morelos... The objective card for Rangers, I could put a decent spin on that and say, well, you know, if you're a, an SBFL fan or a Rangers fan, maybe you can find some positives to take from it. But this, I can't take anything positive from that at all. He's fast. That's it. That's that's all I can say. This needs to be like a 78 rated team. If this is an 83 or above, they I mean, even if it's an 83 or an 82, they, they're having a laugh. Let's find out. 80, oh, 82 and a team of the week. Now, in my opinion, that still isn't worth it. Um, we will complete it on this account because I'm an idiot and I will do it. But I, I don't think this card is, is worth anyone doing. Not even a Dortmund fan should do this. But with that being said, I am going to complete it because I'm stupid. Um... I don't know what they. I don't know what they. Uh, they're trying to do with this SBC. Like I don't know why I'm looking at untradeables either. Like who does this really appeal to? Let's use Pablo. Uh, pop him in there. I've got about 27 of those somewhere. Uh, that's uh, one Bundesliga player. Let's get rid of this. Put gold in. I just don't know what this. Like who this appeals to. This isn't even one of those tempting SBCs. Like I was just saying. Like the people would be like sort of you know. The, the, the type of people who are, are going to do messy are not going to look at this and go, ah, oh, do you know what? Maybe I should do this. Because honestly, I, I can understand why they've dropped an SBC. It, it does make sense for them to drop SBCs daily, especially through this time of um, of the week where the, the Champions League is back on. It makes sense, right? Because obviously we want to, you know, everyone's sort of hyped up for the Champions League. Let's drop Champions League content. Makes sense. I get it. 
and and I'm and I'm all for it. However, what I don't understand is who is this aimed at? What are you what are you trying to achieve with this card? Like Dortmund fans might do it just because you know it's only an 82 rated team, and I'm a Dortmund fan. Fine, I'll get it done. But apart from a Dortmund fan, I don't think anyone aside a content creator is realistically going to look at this and go. Yeah, don't mind that. Now, I know that's nowhere near, by the way. It's an 81-rated team. I say nowhere near. I'm actually not that far away. Um, what do we need to change? I mean, we've, we've, we're four over on Chem. We just need that one extra rating. If I can get... I don't know who I can switch out for Chem. I mean, the, the defense realistically needs to be changed. So let's go and find Bundesliga. I actually really... I'm really surprised I'm anywhere near that rating. Uh, I might have to buy someone. I'm using Kanate right now. I could use Bender, to be fair, because that's not going to help me out putting Abraham in there. I could use Bender instead of um, instead of Pablo, but I don't realist realistically want to use an 83 rated inform for this card because this card is just it's just not worth your time, honestly. Um, Bundesliga, let's go. What are we saying? Uh, let's go. Let's go 3k and just have a look to see what's about. Uh, let's go defensive 3k. If I can get like a Jonathan Tarr or something for I don't know. Let's just let's just search up Jonathan Tarr. See how much we can get him for. Uh, not 3k, 4k maybe. Yeah, I'll do. I'll, I'll buy one for what 38 or something. Uh, 3.5. Let's get him. That should be enough for that. Uh, if I replace Stark, for instance. Apparently that takes me to an 85 rated team. Let's let's get a, an error. Brilliant. Well done, you. This is this is this is great content. Right back in, and I've built the team again. I've made a couple of changes, and we've just got it complete. So Jonathan Tarr is uh, just enough to tip it over the edge. I've had to bring in uh, Giroud on the right and Perrin uh, left back, but uh, that is 72 chemistry, 82 rated team. It's a waste, in my opinion. I don't know whether this is tradable or not. It is tradable. Um, I think I think it's a waste. But I'm, I'm probably going to do a video on it just for the sake of it, really. But um, I do think it's a waste. I, I don't know whether other people are looking at this and going, Oh, actually, no, I really like that card. But I just I looked at it and I genuinely couldn't see anything. I couldn't see a reason why anyone would look at it and go, Yes, that is a, that is a good-looking card. I, I apologize if you look at that and you're actually thinking, No, it's good. I like it. And if you do like it, then that's awesome. You know, if, it, if it suits you and it fits the way you play or what you wanted from today's content, that's awesome. I'm not here to say that you're wrong. Uh, there's no smoke. He's not walking out. Nothing. Uh, well, at least we had some sort of animation. I did one the other day. It had nothing. It just popped up. And it was like quite a high-rated, expensive card. But just to have another look at it, I mean, now that it's a right mid, the low uh, defensive work rate is actually good. High attacking work rate, that's good. He's got a two-star weak foot, which is not which is awful. And then three-star skills, which I can live with. But because the weak foot is so bad, it's actually not great at all, is it? And then bar pace and dribbling ability, and of course stamina, there's nothing about that card that screams yes, you know? Finishing's poor, long shots are poor, composure's poor, agility, balance, all poor, uh, vision is poor. Please, someone, give me a positive about this card. If you honestly, if you like it, that's awesome. I just, I can't. I don't. I only did it. I literally only did it for content purposes. This is going to give us a rare Electrum, and this is, um, this is the pack where we pack Messi. So, that's pretty cool. What do we need here? Um, players from the same league, minimum five, and then one rare Champions League card with a 78 rated team. It's a little bit steep. So there is inside the box done. I literally just filled it with uh, with Serie A players. I've got one over on the rating, but honestly, I'm all right with it. I didn't e I literally didn't even pay attention to the requirements. I just filled it out with uh, Serie A players and hoped that that would be enough, and, and it was. I put one Braga player at right wing just in case I needed an extra league in there, but generally speaking, I, I did that without looking. Um, I would have thought there's no new league or anything. No, that's that's cool. Uh, we'll double check objectives because you know what they're like. They sometimes take ages to update things. No, it doesn't look like they've dropped anything for today, which is uh, which is a shame. I mean, Hakimi is something. That rare uh, player's pack is, again, something. But the problem with Hakimi is, honestly, it is shocking. Absolutely shocking. 
I'm not normally one to complain either, to be fair, because the content the last few days, for me personally, hasn't been that bad. You know, Munier was okay. I, I quite liked him. He's actually a really enjoyable card to use. Uh, Quadrado looked bad, but then when I used him, was actually very good. I'm kind of hoping the same's going to happen with Akimi, but he's got so many things wrong with him, whereas Quadrado, realistically, you only had like one or two. I just can't see it happening. I digress though, let me know what you think of it in the comments, whether you think it's a good SBC or a bad SBC, I just don't understand why they didn't pump it up, you know, 84, 85 rated, right mid, give him some decent stats, make him semi-usable, he's not going to be the best right mid in the game, no one's going to go, right, well, you know, let's put him in ahead of everyone else, you know, Messi's out tomorrow for instance, he's probably going to be a right wing, no one's going to go, I'd rather have Hakimi than Messi, it's just something extra that people will actually grind for and, and submit a team for. I don't see many people doing this one, which in my opinion is why EA released it in the first place. Never mind. Rear Electrum players back. Let's get Team of the Group Stage messy and everyone can go home happy. Or not. I tell you what, the pack luck on this account is horrendous. I, I get nothing all the time. I've, I've opened so many packs on this account and I get... Never mind. Never mind. We've got ourselves an icon. We've got Joe Gomez who um, obviously is going to get upgraded if you've got the uh, the UCL version. Now, my pack luck on this account is shocking. It really is bad. On my other account, the Road to Glory is brilliant, but uh, on this account, not so much. We've got a, a 2K silver in there. Can't grumble. We'll put all that in the club. I'll, uh, I'll chuck that up there, and we'll get rid of that. Why not? Uh, but that's going to do it for today's video. Absolutely terrible player SBC today, but um, hopefully... They can redeem themselves by making Messi an 84-rated team with an inform tomorrow. If you have enjoyed today's video, do me a favor and hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And until the next time, goodbye. Football Index. The game changed. Download the app now.